This is called the T-Run. Now we're going to be working on our acceleration and deceleration. Mr. Best is going to take us through. He's going to accelerate up, Sean in his feet, and he's going to go lateral to the left cone. Once he's touched the cone, he's going to laterally come back and hit the right cone. Back to the middle and a sprint back. Pass it on, Mr. Best. This is a reaction drill for you to do at home, okay? All you need is four cones or four items to place on the ground, set up just like this behind me, okay? This one is a, is a reaction drill, but it also works on your agility. So what's going to happen is I'm going to call out a color cone. For example, if I call out blue, Mr. O'Brien moves backwards to the blue cone, touching the cone and returns back to the middle position. Okay, let's give that a go. What? Blue, green, what? Thanks, Mr. O'Brien. So that one there, as you can see, Mr. O'Brien was keeping his body nice and low, okay, and moving uh, in the direction of the cone. So if it's behind you, you're moving backwards. If it's to the side, you're moving laterally um, with your shoulders facing um, forward, all right? To make this a little bit harder, all right, I can add a footy. Okay, running with the ball in two hands and uh, only pulling your hand off the ball to touch the cone. So if we go again, blue, red, white, and nice, pull it back there. So just with that one, if you don't have uh, coloured cones at home, that's okay. All you need to do is place an item um, each where each of those markers are. It can be, uh, you know, a t-shirt, it could be a bit of rubbish, it can be anything. All you do then is you number the cone, or number the markers, one to four. So the green one would be number one, white number two, blue number three, red number four. And it works exactly the same. So if we give that one a go, two, three, two, and number one. Nice, good job Mr. O'Brien. Give that one a go at home and let us know how you go. Thanks.